Welcome to this week's Christmas episode. Just like when your parents got divorced, now you get two Christmas episodes, and unfortunately, this one is not the nice one. This has gone so horribly wrong. I do not have a recipe pre-planned. However, I do have this food and drink magazine, winter edition. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna randomly pick one out of this blindly, and whatever drink it is, I will go ahead and make it. Randomly flipping through ads. Ad, oh. So this isn't going well. We have unfortunately selected a drink with Jägermeister in it. It is called Nakatomi Nog. Thank you, whoever made this. It has Jägermeister, spiced rum, mint liqueur, cinnamon syrup, and eggnog in it. I don't have a clue what that's gonna taste like other than not great. But let's do it. I found the rum. What else do we need? Mint liqueur. I'm not sure if it's supposed to be green, but eggnog, cinnamon syrup, which appears to have Settled. I have no idea what eggnog actually is. A rich and creamy holiday classic. It says on the back, in our humble opinion, This is the best eggnog money can buy. Let's find out if that's true. It smells like old milk. I'm not really getting any of the spices it said were there. Wow, that's real bad. Sorry, President's Choice. If this is the best eggnog, eggnog is real sh**. <laughs> it tastes like spices and cake batter. I, 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 I hear you're supposed to add rum to it, so. It has now changed color. Oh, that was too much rum. It's really not looking good for the future of this drink. It just says add everything to a shaker, shake and strain. So let's do that. For those following along at home, uh, according to this recipe, it's an ounce of Jägermeister. So we're off to a great start. Half an ounce of spiced rum, half an ounce of mint liqueur, half an ounce of cinnamon syrup, one ounce of eggnog. Why is it so viscous? Time for some ice. Okay. This has gone so horribly wrong. Oh, oh. this looks fancy. So this is what it's supposed to look like. Keep this image in mind. Brown. <laughs> this is, <laughs> this is not, this is not what we were supposed to make. This looks like fucking Shrek the Halls. <laughs> I guess it's more festive. <laughs> Let's try this. Yeah, I'm basically just getting a ton of mint. So we're gonna remake this real quick and use less mint. That's real, not great. Um, okay, <coughs> we're back with the schnapps now. Get out of here. We're gonna redo it with schnapps. Well, you know what? I forgot the coffee. Not like that would have saved it. Coffee and mint kind of tastes horrible. For the record, this is coffee, it's just not in a mug. Attempt number two. A random splash of coffee to make up for the fact that we are not using the cold brew Jägermeister. Quarter of an ounce of mint liqueur this time. Okay, let's try this thing. 
Not bad. Tastes festive, I guess. Still too much mint. Well, I think we learned something today and that is to not trust the LCBO food and drink magazine because they do not have your best interest at heart. I cannot say I particularly recommend this drink because it is bad. Um, if you liked this video, remember to like and subscribe. I'm trying to put out videos every Wednesday. See ya.